I'm working to perfect the chip dip plate. Let's do it in under a minute. Whoop. So here we go again. This time I'm flattening out the clay with a rolling pin rather than my hand. My hand often leaves unwanted ridges. Using a rolling pin helps for more level consistency. With a rolling pin, sometimes a lip can form around the edge of the clay. So just take your finger to compress it together to make sure the clay is uniform. And make sure the bottom's thick enough because you don't want to ruin another one. Learning from mistakes. Just shaping that inner curvature for fashion. Take it off and let it dry for a little bit on the back. Once it's a little drier, take it off the back. Use a wire cutter to release it. Second bat, flippity flip, ba da! Let that baby dry some more, bring it back, and give it a little trimmy trim. Center it, secure it to the wheel, and start to even out the base. Ba 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 burnish it. Heat it up. Damp of approval. And she's ready for a bisque fire. There you have it, folks.